Hey YouTube, I hacked your games here. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to set up a local FTP server. The uh, you could use this, say, like to use a program like uh, this program that I'm making. You could use it for this, like say FTP control V. Yeah, you could use it for this instead. Instead of saving, uh, instead of making uh, an FTP server like on some website like DriveHQ, 00 Webhost, stuff like, and uh, websites like that, so you can set up a local one that'll access files on your computer. So let's get started. First, you want to go to Control Panel, uninstall, wait, never mind. Go to Programs, turn Windows features on and off, and we'll just wait, wait for this. This takes a while. I'm just going to uh, pause the video. Oh, okay. Didn't take that long this time. So when you uh get your uh whatever stuff, you uh you want to make sure this is clicked and this. Then click the plus here. Make sure all three of these are clicked. And uh yeah, these are clicked too. And leave these uh how they are. And click OK. Then now you want to go to the start menu. Search IIS. And wait for the security prompt. Now you want to go to click here, then right click on sites and click F add FTP site. You can if uh you sh you can name yours whatever you want, but I'll name mine localhost. And your physical path, like what files you wanted to access. I'm just gonna do my C drive. So after you set your physical path and host name. Our site name, then go to next binding. You should set your IP address, or you could enable a virtual host, say like ftp.drivehq.com. You could do that. With this, well, or you could just set your IP address and set the port to the default 20, uh, 21. Make sure start FTP site automatically is checked and no SSL. Go to next authentication. Uh, I'll do basic authorization should be to all users and permissions to uh, should uh, and read should be checked for permissions. Then you could finish it, and then there you see you have your FTP site. You can now you can open up Google Chrome and do your FTP and then your IP address, and then here you go. There's your C drive, Windows. Uh, yeah, program files, Activision, all that stuff. Now you can you know, download stuff and whatever. See, there's the picture. Then you could uh, it, it'll download stuff. See, downloading now. Well, so see ya. I guess that's the end of the tutorial.